Mended hearts means our hearts have been fixed uh, and that we can lead a normal life. The Dayton, Ohio Chapter 61 was chartered in June of 1971. It, they had 17 members initially and they were all heart patients and their caregivers uh, when they got started. Nationally, Mended Hearts was started 60 years ago, so we're pretty, you know, you, we came in pretty soon after they were, they were chartered. Our chapter is made up of survivors and their caregivers. If I had to describe one word for Mended Hearts, it would be caring. That's, that's the, the, to me, that, that's an all-encompassing word that describes uh, you know, the organization and the people, is caring. I am so thankful for Mended Hearts because it gave me the opportunity to realize that uh, I did have a reason for living, and I would have missed so many things uh, that a lot of people take for granted every day. You, you take for granted your children, your grandchildren, being able to go to work, but, but because someone took the time to visit me and give me that information, I was able to um, recover from that depression. My heart had been fixed. It had been repaired, but my heart was still aching because I thought my life was over, and I found that it wasn't. When you think your life is over, and, and at that point I really did. I believed that you know I was, uh, I was probably you know going to die soon, and and to have somebody in front of you saying, hey, you know what? Look at me. I'm in, I'm in great shape. I feel good. Just do what what the doctors tell you, and, and you know, you're, there's a good chance you're gonna be good. That is a, it's a tremendous relief. So after I had my heart attack two years ago, my son reminded me of that visit, and um, because I, I had told him how much it meant to me. And so uh, you know, I, I contacted Barb and, uh, and said, you know, how can I be a help, and, and here I am. Everybody that I've met, uh, our members are, Pretty dedicated people. I mean, the, the visitors, uh, that, uh, they're uh, very sincere people, and they, we like to think, we, we all like to think we're doing some good for our fellow human beings. That's basically it. I always say I get more out of this, a whole lot more than I ever give, because you, you get to meet people, you, you realize that you are helping people sometimes, but a lot of times they help you. When you go in and, and visit somebody who, uh, who's had two or three heart attacks and they're 80 years old, for somebody who's 60, 62, that's, a, that's like, wow, you know, I, I can be there. You know, so I get more out of that than I ever give that, that gentleman. While the doctors and nurses can tell the patients, you know, you're going to experience this or you're going to experience that, when they hear it from someone who's been there and done that, they're a lot more accepting of it, and they can really believe that you know what you're talking about because you've experienced yourself. They're glad to see you, and uh, you, of course, you, and I, I, I'm like the doctor doctor. I'm his poster boy, you know. And, and after they find out how old I am, and that I've been through the whole same thing, and I'm walking around. There's a lot of life after heart surgery. And that gives, I think that helps. And then later on when you see the patient in the room and talk to them, the patient, why, that makes, I, I'm hoping that makes them feel good to see somebody walking around that's been through what they've gone through. Mended Hearts is one of the stars of the heart. We provide a very good service to heart patients and their families because we give them uh, the gift of hope. That whole beat goes on uh, thing is, is uh, it means a lot to me there as far as, yeah, you know, there is, there's life tomorrow, there's life the day after, you know, uh, uh, everything is going to be fine.